Welcome to Sherwood's Garlic Confit Spread channel, where I show you how to use my famous garlic confit spreads and all different types of recipes. Today, I'm showing you how to make smoked and grilled garlic confit chicken wings on a pit barrel cooker. I brine the chicken wings for 48 hours in two cups of 5% salt brine, a third cup amino acids, and a quarter cup sriracha. Then laid them out on a cooling rack, patted them dry, and stuck them back in the refrigerator for another two hours to get the skin nice and dry so they crisp up while cooking. I got the chimney coal started going while the wings dried in the fridge because both take time till they're ready to cook. Because I did a salt brine, I didn't add any additional salt to the seasoning blend that I added to the wings before being smoked, so I put together the five pepper seasoning blend, which consists of equal parts, one teaspoon each of black pepper, white pepper, cayenne pepper, hatch green chili pepper, and paprika pepper. Once the coals were ready, I dumped them on top of the mesquite lump charcoal that I had inside the coal basket at the bottom of the pit barrel cooker. We're gonna be basting the wings before we grill them later, so you can keep the seasoning minimal during the smoking stage. The pit barrel cooker is such a versatile cooker. You can hang whole ducks or turkeys on hooks to smoke them, or use the grill grate like you see here to lay out wings, brisket burn ends, or even bacon. And once lit, this thing goes all day, so you can cook a ton of things on this baby before the coals die out. I use this at least once a week. Mm. Save some of the seasoning and add some neutral oil and two ounces of my dark roasted garlic confit spread to it and make a basting sauce so you have a way to baste the wings in some garlicky, peppery flavor while it's smoking. Please check out the video where I show you how to make my amazing dark roasted garlic confit in another video. Pull the wings once the internal temp hits above 165. These wings look incredible already and we haven't even grilled them yet. Make sure your grill is nice and hot, baste the wings in that dark roasted garlic confit five pepper sauce, and toss the wings on the grill for a few minutes to add some nice color and crispiness for the wings. At this point, you could add more sauce, but the phenomenally layered flavors from the salty umami brine to the spicy pepper basting sauce makes it unnecessary. Maybe something sweet like honey or maple syrup drizzle could have rounded out the flavors a bit more and added some flair for presentation. Hmm. Maybe next time. Thank you for supporting my channel.